Hello dear friends, welcome back to your favorite channel, where we bring you trending and interesting news from around the world. May I quickly crave your indulgence to please subscribe to this channel. Please hit the bell icon so you can get notification whenever we post new stories. Thank you so much guys, I appreciate your support. Nigerian Army reveals why they cannot expose the BH sponsors. The Nigerian Army has said it is not their right to expose the people who are sponsoring the BH guys in the country. The Nigerian Army Coordinator of Defense Media Operations, Major General John Enenche, stated this at a media briefing on Thursday morning in Abuja. Major General Enenche admitted that the Army knows that some criminal individuals have heavy financial backing. But the major task for the military is to fight against terrorism and other criminality in the country. Major General Enenche explained that the National Intelligence Agency and the Department of State Se Secrets State Services were responsible for revealing the sponsors of this terrorist group, group as it were. He also said it is not the duty of the army to uncover the sponsors of these BH guys. The military duty is to remain in the front line and defeat the BH group. And other criminality and that is what we are doing to help and to protect the citizens we have the national intelligence agency and the department of state security services it is their responsibility to gather information on the sponsors of these guys and not the military to do that he reiterated he further admitted that the army is aware that some crook agencies have heavy economic backing. However, its foremost venture is to combat terrorism and different criminality. He defined that the National Intelligence Agency, the NIA, and the Department of State Services, the DSS, had been accountable for revealing the sponsors. It is now not the responsibility of the army to find the sponsors. Our obligation is to stay put in the front line and defeat terrorism and different illegal activities and that is what we are doing. We have the National Intelligence Agency and the Direct Department of State Security Services. It is their accountability to collect the information and reveal those who are sponsoring these groups and not the military, Major General Enenchi um, further reiterated. Well, guys, it is what it is. What are your thoughts concerning this? How do you mean it is not the responsibility of the military? If you know it, then you reveal it as it were. That is what we could also say. We just need to be careful. You know, if you know what it is, go ahead and say it. You reveal the information and that goes a long way to actually um, make sure or ensure that uh, these guys are defeated because you weaken them once you expose their sponsors their sponsors will not like to be seen in the public so you don't have to say that it is not your responsibility or even if you agree if, if we agree that it is not your responsibility then whose responsibility is it at the end of the day so the military cannot continue to tell us that it is not their responsibility you know them so now you've ag ag agreed and acknowledged that you know them if you know them then make it public if you know them and you know their sponsors, why not go after their sponsors at the end of the day? Revealing their sponsors to the international community and to everyone would further, you know, weaken, you know, that weak, that link point. Because who wants to be identified as sponsoring, you know, um, terrorism as it were? Nobody wants to, no country wants to be identified with sponsoring them. Nobody wants to be I identified with, you know, being involved in sponsoring illegality and, uh, you know, a group that is involved in killing people, maiming people and all what have you. That is the way things work and that is how it should be. So you don't have to come and tell us, uh, is it the National Information Agency or the National Intelligence Agency that are actually yeah, telling us what is happening? Why do you now come to give us reports as the Nigerian Army? Why do you come to the forefront to give us reports that, okay, this is what is happening or this is what you have gathered? So it is really, really sad and unfortunate. I stand to be corrected if I am wrong. 
But honestly speaking, you know, the Nigerian army needs to give their report. If you cannot do it alone, you know, then have a, 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 a synergy with the National Intelligence Agency, with the DSS. Come together, have a press conference, as it were, reveal all the things that needs to be revealed so that people will get information and know what is going on. You don't keep people in the dark. It doesn't work that way. So all these things ought not to be like this. You need to carry people along, tell people what is happening, let people know. You can be fighting these guys for the past 10 years and they, you know, they, there's no sign that they are being defeated. Instead, they are waxing more strong and more stronger every day. So who would accept this and take these excuses? You know, and the little the, 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 the funds that are being expended, you know, is really, really massive daily. Huge expenses as it were. So guys, it is really, really sad and unfortunate if you'd ask me. I stand to be corrected. But um, I think what the Nigerian army is doing is not really um, right. But I don't know. Probably that is what the law says or what the constitution says. I stand to be corrected. But really, it is not. Uh, it doesn't make sense to me. So it is what it is. Well, be that as it were, let's quickly take a few reactions. Let's hear what people are saying. How do you defeat an enemy group that keeps receiving reinforce reinforcement? When you know the, those that are strengthening them, but choose to ignore them, does it show you are serious? The right thing to do is to cut further reinforcement by cutting off their, sub, their supply line. Moreover, are the various security agencies not supposed to work together? Can you see yourselves that you are not sincere? Exactly. These guys are not sincere. These guys are not sincere. And it is really, really sad and unfortunate. It does not make sense in any way. They are not sincere. Something is wrong somewhere. Jimo Abiodun says, If you people refuse to expose the BH sponsor simply because of the money you people are getting from the BH issue, God will expose them. So, what Jimo is saying is that they are refusing to expose them because they are getting money. And it probably might just be true. It probably might just be true. You never can tell. Everything is possible in this country, Nigeria. Everything is possible. But they shouldn't be sabotaging themselves. Not really sabotaging Nigeria as it were. But the army should not be sabotaging themselves. Because if they are receiving, if it is true that they are receiving money from other places, uh, from those, all these guys, and they are not doing what is needed, it sure means that they are sabotaging themselves and sabotaging the work that they are doing. So it is really, really sad. Mohammed Goza says, look, the army says it's not their responsibility to expose the BH sponsor. Then you are saying... How will is it not their responsibility? Who would accept that? Is the question that we are saying. Okafi Festo says, What nonsense is the army chief saying? That it is not the responsibility of the army to reveal the sponsors of the BH guys. If the army knows and cannot reveal it, then it is a shame to the army and the president because this is not acceptable. Exactly, it is not acceptable if you ask me. So how do you win the war without blocking their financiers? What a nation we find ourselves in is the question. And open says that's right. If the federal government has, if the federal government that has the power to expose them, but the question is, will they do so? Is the army not part of the federal government? So what are we saying? That is nonsense. They are the sponsor themselves. They are the sponsors themselves. So since they know the sponsors and they are they are not willing to reveal, then it is they, they know the sponsor. It is within them. I mean, it is within themselves, you know. Or someday they will be exposed by the help of God. You know, if you are not if you are not exposing them, remember you will retire one day, so all your family are not saved from them. If it's uh, even has nothing to do with their family, as it were, that is going too far. But the challenge of the issue is, if they are refusing to expose them, then they are hiding something. Musa Abdul Haziz says, if Nigerian Army cannot expose the BH sponsors, it means that they are sacrificing Nigeria's life, no matter they are not, and it doesn't make sense. Look at the number of uh, soldiers that are actually, you know, going to battle daily. Something is wrong somewhere. The army is yet economic. Okay, the, okay. The, the army is being economical with the truth. Why waste your lives? No wonder one could investigate the helicopters that drop weapons to bandits, headsmen, etc., and the BH to waste innocent lives and properties in this nation. But is this the change promise? In 2015 or incoming 2023 may god forbid says asinobi humphrey for that you can't cure a disease without treating on its syndrome meaning that you can never win the battle since you can't name the sponsors simply put 
this opinion to me is really not uh, a wrong one. So how will you say you cannot name it? If you cannot name it, then make sure that the people who are responsible, name them. Ensure that they are named because we cannot continue like this. Well, it's what it is, guys. What are your thoughts concerning this particular news story? Kindly drop by at the comment section. Let us know what your thoughts are. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Please hit the bell icon so you can get notification whenever we post new stories. Thank you so much, guys. I appreciate your support. And I'll see you on the other news. Thank you and bye for now.